Alright, so uh, we're going to learn to uh, about functions in this very lesson. So let's say you, if you have, uh, let's say, let's talk about, let's call this figure 1. Okay, to enlighten you what functions are. Okay, let's say this is x. Okay, x is a set that contains 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, and okay, this is x, and this is y. Y is a set that contains 3, 5, 7, 9. Alright, so what happens is that 1 maps onto 3, okay, 2 maps onto 5. 3 maps onto 7, 4 maps onto 9. Okay, as compared to figure 2, okay, we have two sets, x and y. Okay, uh, okay, so for x, we have 1, 2, 3, 4. We've got 3, 5, 7, 9, 1 in this case maps onto 3, okay, and 5, okay, 2 maps onto 7, okay, 3 maps onto 9, okay, and 4 maps onto 7, okay. Now, by definition, Okay, a function occurs when each element of map or element of x is mapped to exactly one element of y. Okay. Let me just write down here. Okay. Okay, what's a function? A function occurs when each element of x is mapped to exactly okay mapped to only one element of y Okay, so each function of each element of x is only mapped to one element of y. So this process is called a function. Okay, this process is called a function. So let's look at the relationship for figure 1. Okay, figure 1 shows the relationship that of a function why because one maps onto three okay the starting element one maps onto three okay um what about number two two maps to five three maps to seven four maps to nine okay so for the relationship in figure 8.1 it satisfies the the condition that each element of x is mapped to exactly one element of y so this relationship is called a function. All right. So this relationship is called a function. Okay. Also known as mapping. Okay. So figure eight, figure. <coughs> so figure one shows a functional relationship. Okay, but figure 2, you can see 1 will map into 3, 1 will also map into 5, okay, in this very case, because 1 maps to, we write this symbol here, 1 maps to 3, and 1 also maps to 5, 
okay you can see therefore okay it is not a function all right so figure two okay this condition is not satisfied where each element of x is mapped to only one element of y hence it is not a function all right so okay let me scroll down to the next page so just remember just bear in mind okay this is a function okay let me box it up okay this is a function this is not a function okay not a function okay probably underline this a bit better okay why because one maps of the three and one maps to five there should only be one image so these are called images as well all right <coughs> okay let's scroll down the second page uh, okay so functions generally are denoted by small letters okay they can be called f g h you know e z etc okay <coughs> okay if you let uh, f to denote the function okay uh, you can also write that f x is equals to 